Today, we're going to be talking about the Vikings. So this is the best historical fiction series for tweens that teaches about the Vikings from a Christian worldview. Well, I'm not a tween, but I still really enjoyed it. So can anybody read this or is it just for tweens? Well, anybody can read it. I used it as a read aloud, but you can also hand it to your tween and they can read it. So this series deals with the Vikings from a Christian worldview or perspective, and it's a really good series, right? It is, and it deals with some really tough topics. It deals with trusting God in very difficult situations and the power of forgiveness. So did you love this series or did you hate it? I loved it. Of course you did. It's hands down my absolute favorite historical fiction series to teach kids about the Vikings, but it does so while teaching biblical godly principles. So the principles that it teaches throughout the series are really things that the young kids and even young adults really can take and absorb and apply in their lives. Absolutely. So tell us a little bit about the storyline in this series. So this story starts out in Ireland and it tells the story of Bree and Devon, their brother and sister, and a group of Vikings are raiding their area and they both get captured. And so it, the, the story throughout the series follows their, follows their journey in the boat to the Vikings' home, and it really follows how they share their faith in God with the Vikings that have captured them. That's really cool. Now, I know that you've used this as a read-along for the kids or a read-aloud for the kids because I listened to it multiple times, and I love this series. It, it really draws you in. It's good for young adults, but it's also fun for adults as well. It is. This this storyline was asked to be read more than once by our children. This series really makes history come alive in a story format. So you can learn a lot, but it's a lot of fun. It's a good series. Tell me the bottom line here. Are we going to get rid of this series or are we going to put it back on the shelf? We are going to put it back on the shelf. Wow, after we've already read it multiple times? Well, I really would like to keep it and perhaps read it to our grandchildren someday. So these books are well-researched, well-written. There's no need to read a boring history book when you can read these books and have history come alive. So check out the link below to get your copy of this series today.